Duncan Performer Maverick pickup. As you can see, it's held on by screws at top and bottom of the sound hole. It's a magnetic pickup, and for years I used it as I hosted an open mic. I always thought it was very nice, it made my guitar sound very natural. Only cost about 29 bucks at Guitar Center. And which is, was just an excellent value and worked very well. EQ it right and it sounds terrific. However, I've recently purchased a Lawrence A300 and I wanted to show the differences between the two. Oops. This is an E guitar, unplugged. Momentarily, we will hear it coming through my crate CA-15. with the Bill Lawrence. As you can see, it's held to, it goes right and slips right in and is held by the tension of this uh, spring here. This one costs a little more than the uh, Seymour Duncan. This is you can get under 50 bucks. First thing you're going to notice is that it will need to be EQ'd a little differently than the Seymour Duncan, the Seymour Duncan. It's a louder guitar, a louder pickup rhythm. Right off the bat, and it can handle highs a little better. And so, whereas um, I, I pull back on the highs so that they're about nine o'clock, but the Seymour Duncan put this at about twelve o'clock.
Here I've got the, again, volume just up about nine. We're going to dunk it ahead at about twelve. Neither one of them has uh, EQ on them or a uh, volume thing, so it's just plug and play. I think this is very sweet sound. Naturalness of the guitar, the natural sound of the guitar. The guitar is kind of natural, but man, would.